everybody, Hood and Cobra Commander 788 here, and it's been a while since we've done one of these quick shots, so let's take a very brief look at the 1986 G.I. Joe Marine, codename Leatherneck. And Leatherneck uh, joined but did not replace the first G.I. Joe Marine, the 1983 Gung Ho. And for some reason, as a kid, um, I really had uh, an affinity for these Marine characters, both Gung Ho and Leatherneck, to the point that I actually got one of these camouflage marine utility caps and I used to wear that around as a kid. Uh, this figure uh, has some paint wear so I may actually replace this figure before I'm ready to do a full review on it uh, but this is a figure that I really do like. Um, I like the camouflage, I like the realistic military look and I really like this accessory. He comes with a rifle that was one of my favorite in all of the 80s G.I. Joe. This is an excellent accessory. Uh, it's got a backpack here uh, so Leatherneck is one that I really look forward to reviewing, and he's got some interesting uh, elements about his design uh, and the face sculpt. We'll talk about all of that when we do the full review, but for now, that's a quick look at Leatherneck. I hope you enjoyed it. Keep an eye on this channel for full G.I. Joe toy reviews, and I will see you next time.